we are today. Many things have changed, but one thing remains the same. Our desire at First Baptist Church is to know Christ and to make Him known. First Baptist Church is now celebrating what God is doing in our midst. The Boys and Girls Club of Lenore County is currently leasing the Roy Poole Family Life Center. This is an exciting endeavor for them and for us. In 2017, First Baptist Church chartered a troop with Trail Life USA and American Heritage Girls. Each of these troops focus on outdoor adventure along with service to the church, our country, and to the community. Still today, First Baptist Church has several ministries that continue to thrive. We have an active WMU ministry, an excellent prayer shawl ministry, several Bible studies throughout the week, and we have hosted wonderful concerts in our beautiful sanctuary, including the North Carolina Baptist Singers and Orchestra and Keith and Kristen Getty. First Baptist Church has a bright future, but it's important that we remember where we came from. To do that, let's take a walk down memory lane. Our church traces its roots back to around 1770 when a small church was built near Southwest Creek. In 1844, a new church was built a few hundred yards down Richlands Road, not far from the visitor center at the junction of US 258 and US 70. It was named Harriet's Chapel in honor of Miss Harriet Jones, who donated the land and paid for the building. This is a current modern day replica of what that building may have looked like. W.P. Biddle was their first pastor, and the church was involved in the Battle of Harriet's Chapel during the Civil War. A third site in our church's history occurred in 1857 when members Jesse Jackson, S.E. Lofton, Pickney Hardy, and James Wooten moved the church into the town of Kinston. J.D. Huffman was their first pastor in this building. This church is White Rock Presbyterian Church which is the current modern-day version of the church when it was moved into town in 1857. As the church continued to grow, it moved downtown. This is the church that was built in 1891 and was used for 14 years before it was deemed structurally unsafe. It was replaced during the time between 1913 and 1917. The new building was completed in November of 1920. During the next 12 years, pastors serving were Marshall Craig, Lee White, and W.H. Moore. The church would stay here until January 29, 1981, when Kinston residents and church members were shocked to witness an early morning fire that would destroy its sanctuary and its beloved stained glass windows. During the years at this location, First Baptist Church had a thriving choir and many active Sunday school classes that ministered to the needs of the community, spread the gospel, and helped grow the church. In 1978, First Baptist Church acquired 14 acres of land at the intersection of Rouse and Cary Roads for future growth. 
a decision was made to relocate to the Rouse Road site, which is the church's present location. New construction began in March of 1982, and by September of 1983, the Fellowship Hall at the new site was finished sufficiently for its first services. The sanctuary was completed in November of 1984. Following the departure of Pastor Ray Hodge in 1988, Dr. Aubrey Jones was called in January of 1989. In the 1990s, the church built a covered walkway, replaced sanctuary windows, and initiated a preschool ministry. Perhaps the largest step occurred when ground was broken for a Family Life Center in 2001. On February 2, 2003, the facility was dedicated as the W. Roy Poole Family Life Center. The next pastor for First Baptist Church was Dr. Chuck Towery, who began his pastorate in January of 2005. During these years, committees were changed into teams and a website was developed for the church. Our next and current pastor was called in October 2013. Reverend John Hoover arrived with a growing family and immediately set out to improve community outreach and work diligently to increase attendance and membership. Kinston's First Baptist Church is now at a literal and figurative crossroad sitting at the corner of Rouse and Cary Roads. Cary Road is planned for extension westward to US 258 North, which will put the campus in its beautiful building and towering cross for all to see as they come into Kinston from the growing northwest part of the county. What does the future hold for First Baptist Church? Only the Lord knows. But it's our job to remain faithful to knowing Christ and making Him known in Kinston and throughout the world.